In this video, I'm going to show you how to easily remove and install an inner tube for a tire, either belonging to your lawn mower or your lawn cart, just simply using a screwdriver. The first thing you want to do is grab a screwdriver and insert it between the uh, tire and the rim. Just be careful not to stab yourself in the hand with the screwdriver. Now, what you want to do is use a screwdriver as sort of a pry bar to separate the tire from the rim. Slowly do this until you see a clear separation between the rim and tire. And then pull apart with your hands. This specific tire and inner tube come from a uh, lawn cart. The uh, replacement tube was bought at uh, Tractor Supply. Removing the uh, old inner tube was the easy part. Now you have to install the new tube by lining up the stem to the hole in the rim. Once you get that part done, you're going to take the rest of the inner tube and put it around the, uh, the rim. The next part is to get part of the rim into the tire. An easy way to do this is to turn the rim upside down, keep the inner tube facing the ground, and then basically gently get part of the uh, tire around the rim. Now I'm using a screwdriver here to pry the tire back on the rim, but be careful not to puncture the inner tube with the screwdriver. Once you get the tire on, the next step is to push in the inner tube inside the tire. To do this, what I like to do is fold the inner tube around where the blue line is and folding it and tucking it into the tire. This is going to be a slow and fun process, but patience will get you there. Again, keep on folding and tucking the inner tube inside the tire. Once you're done folding in the inner tube, you want to double check against the tire and the rim to make sure that the inner tube is not pinched. Also bounce, the, uh, bounce or hit the tire to make sure that the inner tube opens up inside. Again just double check to make sure that the inner tube is not pinched against the tire and rim. Once you verify that everything looks good, it's time to grab your tire inflator and start uh, pumping some air. Before you start, double check your tire's PSI rating. Finally, as you inflate the tire, just double check to make sure that the inner tube is expanding properly. I like to do this by pumping air into the tire. Stopping the uh, tire inflator and just double checking the tire for the looking for.
Again, the key is to inflate the inner tube to the proper PSI as indicated by the manufacturer. Finally, screw on your stem cap and you're good to go. Thank you for watching and please don't forget to subscribe.